sunny in Ireland, you don't see that at all. It comes out once a year. <laughs> See, when I come to Ireland, what happens? Look at Blue this. Blue skies, my friend. Blue skies. 24 degrees today. It's a heat wave. Sunglasses. He's wearing shorts. The one time a year that he actually gets to do that. So we woke up early this morning after a late night. Be ready for the bus at 7 a.m. this morning. They didn't know what they were doing. I was on time. And we're here at a place called New Grange, which is about 5,000 years old, older than the pyramids. One of the oldest monuments or structure in Ireland. So boys, what do you think? Fabulous. Magic. Yeah. Something special around here. It's legacy. Play the long, yeah. 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 That, that's, that's, that's it. So this is New Grange, over 5,000 years old, older than the pyramids. Incredible experience room when you get to go inside. Unfortunately, you can't take any photos or pictures. When the winter solstice comes through in December, a beam of light will come through and light up the whole tomb for about 17 minutes. And it's just an incredible experience to be in a place where you knew that people stood in the same grounds that you were in 5,000 years ago. And you think about projecting yourself 5,000 years ahead, that's 70, 17. 5,000 years creating this place and still exists today. The outside is a reconstruction of what, what it would look like, but these are all original stones which they found on the ground and rebuilt. I brought my nitro computers because I wanted them to think about legacy, to think about the legacy of this place have left you know, an impression on us 5,000 years later. What is the legacy that you leave behind? What's the legacy that you want to create for your life? There's still plenty of time to do that, but it's your opportunity to create that legacy because to make your mark on this world, what is that legacy? What is that mark that you're gonna leave behind so that people in 7017 can still be talking about you? I'm back on the vlog. Yeah, you're back on the vlog. This is Pat Dibley, my good buddy. Come all the way down, I'm sorry, come all the way up. Galway. Um, thanks buddy, I really appreciate that. Your insights were amazing and uh, like always, shine. Go check out patentedly.com. The master at work, Chef Maurice. Beetroot cured salmon, mm -hmm. a little pickled radish and cucumber salad. It's kind of a we take on uh, Mauritian food, the, the fishermen would eat. Why do we need to go to a restaurant, fancy restaurant, where we can have this guy cook for this? This is what we do with nitro. Family. Oh my god, like yeah. this, so good. The zone, baby. What do we got here? Confit of leg. Duck confit, leg. Yeah. Rolled in uh, tailor and panko. And then these are uh, duck breasts. It's now one o'clock in the morning and the turkey's almost ready. <laughs> <laughs> Thumbs up. Freaking delicious. 
Nope. I'm savoring this. Never had, I think Nick used every pot, pan, dish, <laughs> silverware, cups, wine glasses for this whole entire meal. But awesome job though, buddy. And Great job. See the Chef bin. Maurice. Check the bin. Check the bin. The bin is oh, no. two bins are full. Yeah. <laughs> but none of the food went to waste though. <laughs>